Hello ladies and gents, this is Kano from the Gamer Section back with another review. For today's review is on Tumba Special Edition for the PlayStation 5, Nintendo Switch, and PC. In Tumba, you play as a child that attempts to recover his grandfather's bracelet from the evil, conniving, diabolical pigs. Graphically, Tumba is a retro game to the core where you see that this game is a whole port and not a remaster or remake. You see the PlayStation 1 visuals in the game, which is not bad because to me, it brings back that childhood memory vibe, which is fine. The sound design is the same like the original, which you can hear the attacking of the animals, the sound of the child moving around the whole nine. They kept the essence of the music in the game without any changes like that. The game runs the same as the original, but the whole overall presentation to Tumba is cool for that nostalgia side of the game. Tumba is an open world metrovania. Now it does play in the 2D aspects to it, but you can move around where you can call up areas in the game. Now you start off with a rock type of yo-yo where you can attack your enemies, but the whole goal is to jump on the enemies and you can basically throw them into things that actually can quickly eliminate them. There are collectibles in the game to find like treasures and jewelry too. There are abilities in the game to find, like learning to swim, getting rid of the clouds, etc. Honestly, this game is simple because they have open missions in the game where you have to really figure out where to go, which is not hard. The game does move slow sometimes where you have to go from section to section and when you pause the game, it does take a second to really get into the pause menu and it has that little section to get in there. This game does bring back memories playing this as a kid. You do collect other weapons in the game like boomerangs, etc. It also has some RPG elements to better your character also. I like Tumba, but I don't love it 100% like I used to. I wish this game was more of a remake than a PS1 port. Honestly, this game felt more like a money grab than a remake, and it's cool to a degree, but I felt this game should have been remade with modern graphics and better gameplay from the PS1 days. Now, the gameplay side, the response to a lot of things in the game is slow. Let's say if you want to go from gameplay to the menu side, the game is basically slow when it comes to switching from either or the movement in the game or have some issues moving to, too slow to a degree. The responses to the game is very slow in certain parts of the game, like jumping, for example. It's not slow like that, but you don't see any improvements to that area. I just wish again, and I'm going to say this again, they would have updated the whole game, but it is what it is. The gameplay is okay from what we got. For that, I give Tumba Special Edition a 3 out of 5. Thank you for tuning in to the best place for independent gaming journalism, and that's the Gamer section. Be sure to hit the like button on the video, and please subscribe to the channel.